I am so fucking livid right now. Like, my anger levels are through the fucking roof. Like, I'm so mad. I've just come full circle, okay? But I just want to kindly ask all of the fans if somehow, however miracle it is, if there is fans of Eok somehow out there, I, I, I don't know how, I pray for you, but if you're some fans that are watching this video of Eok and you do not like to hear this character trashed, leave the video. Leave the video. Okay. I am so mad. I am seeing fucking red. Like, I am fucking mad. I'm not mad with Gundam. I'm not mad with the episode. Don't get me wrong. It was a good episode. Just want to clarify. However, Eok is a fucking piece of fucking shit. I fucking cannot stand that piece of shit and what he did in this fucking episode. Oh my... Mm. <laughs> <laughs> that man has transcended the level of stupidity I thought he had. Like, how can you be that fucking dumb? How can you be that fucking dumb? That doesn't even make fucking sense. <laughs> I am just so mad. I am so fucking mad with the Ox character. Just this man, this motherfucker, he is straight up. He accuses, he's getting turbines fucking uh, as a legal organization. He's fucking putting them that name on him. And he's trying to arrest him, getting him killed or whatever. And this motherfucker, he gets this like shit on him. He's like, they're using illegal equipment. But then he uses the fucking illegal equipment in the episode. Are you... Are you serious? Are you fucking sick? Yo! Yo! I am just like, what is this man? This man is a whole new level of crust. And he is just an asshole. And he's so stupid. When I saw that man do, yay! Yay! And he fucking, he does all that shit trying to kill the fucking turbines. I'm like, please. Please, so, so, someone just kill this man. <laughs> Please kill this man. Like, when I saw the two scenes in this episode, when I saw Amina, how she was shooting at the fucking ship, and you just saw the glass breaking, I'm like, oh, that man fucking survived. Oh, my God. And then you saw Naze. He's going in. He's going in with a hammerhead, and he, he barely misses the freaking... Mm. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh. Oh, my God. Oh, why? Why am I so mad? Like, and this, this character is just so... <sighs> I'm just gonna say right now, like... Mm, I want that man to suffer. I want that man to suffer. I, I really want that man to suffer. I do. I want to see Eox blood scattered all over the galaxy. I, I I really do. You know what? No, I take that back. I want this man. I want this man and everyone that's associated with this dumbass to be executed. I, I am... Th this man it has made me so mad. I, I have not been this mad in a long time with a character. Just the character makes me so pissed off just <sighs> okay okay so this episode killed off two characters killed off Naze and Amina and then other characters are part of his crew. For instance, the Turbines. They died. 
thanks to Brain Dead Eok. I'm sad that Naze died. I I'm very sad. Like it was emotional, and I'm like, fuck, the way they died. Like it, it was just like. Fuck. And what really just makes me sad, but it's also just, it makes me more angrier, is the fact that they sent surrender signals and ceasefire signals, and this motherfucker, he fucking ignored you. Are you fucking out of your fucking mind? Are you out of your fucking mind? I they threw ceasefire and surrender, and you still fucking, yo! I okay, I just... Let's just talk about how stupid that is, okay? You're a fucking command. You're a commander. You're a fucking commander. Your your main objective, besides just taking out the person or getting them into custody, is to lower the rate of casualties. You don't want that many casualties. But this motherfucker is like, fuck that shit. I'm just not gonna, you know, do the ceasefire. I'm not gonna listen to this, and I'm gonna go all in and kill this man, like. You're killing fucking innocent people, too! Like, oh my god! When that man was shooting the transport ship, I'm like, oh... I was figuratively slamming my fucking head up against the fucking desk. Like, I, I was just like, are you, are you fucking serious right now? Like, I have a headache with just how angry... I am. I, I, I'm sad that Naze died. But I am angry with how he died. Mm. As you could see, I'm, 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 I'm pretty, you know, I'm mad. I think everybody knows now. So... <sighs> Mm -mm 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 -mm. We knew Nazi was probably going to die. I just be honest here. Yeah, those death flags were unreal for his character. However, to think he would die to the stupidest fucking character in the series. But the fucked up part is, Naze tried to be a good man. He, he he did everything. He was being a very good man throughout the episode. And then the surrender signal and the ceasefire signal. And just... mm -mm -mm. I can't. I, I'm done. I, I, I'm just, I'm done. I, I'm done. I cannot talk about this anymore. <laughs> I'm probably going to label this as a rant because I, th this is not a review. Uh, it's just like... Oh my god. And I just want to clarify, I like this episode. Don't get me wrong. I love Gundam. I love, you know, Iron Blood Orphans. However, Eok, fuck you. Just, just, just fuck Eok. Just, just fuck this motherfucker and everything he stands for. Like, seriously. If this man does not die, I, I, I don't even know what I'm going to do. Just, that's how mad I am. So, you all have a wonderful day or not, wherever you live. Please be safe. Chibi out.